I'm Catherine Pappas. I'm the Relocation Director here at Dickens Michener. And today we are going to take an inside look at Old Mecklenburg Brewery, the oldest brewery in Charlotte, North Carolina. And here today to share with us a few things about OMB is Jocelyn Ruark, who is the Marketing Manager here at OMB. And Jocelyn, tell us a little bit about the brewery. The brewery is, like you said, the oldest in Charlotte, also the largest. We brewed just under 25,000 barrels last year. And we're a traditional German brewery, very proud of that and that heritage. We follow Rheinheim's Gebot, we do very traditional brewing, we only bottle. We have 12 different varieties. Uh, most are seasonals, we follow a very strict traditional seasonal schedule. And then four year rounds, uh, you're drinking our flagship copper, so it's an alt beer, which is very rare. You can only find alt beer here and in Germany, literally. Mm, it's good. So that's our flagship, and then three other year round beers, and then Seasonals throughout the year, probably our most famous is Mechtoberfest. We've won several awards for it internationally. So is it like the Hofbrauer House? Do people like jump up on the on the benches and, and raise raise a glass? Only during Mechtoberfest. Okay, so it gets a little wild in October. <laughs> yes. Good to know. And having all these breweries opening up in town has really added to the flavor of of the whole city atmosphere. Tell us a little bit about how the neighborhood has changed here since OMB opened. Definitely. So when we first opened, we were up the street, like I said, but we were the only people on the street. It was abandoned warehouses and us. So we were definitely a destination that people had to seek out. But now there's us, there's Sugar Creek, there are two distilleries within walking distance, so the neighborhood's really grown out. The development has really followed the light rail. How have y'all seen that impact your business? That's true, the light rail's been a huge impact. Uh, our brewery in itself, we employ over 100 people, so there's a lot of local jobs and everything associated with all these businesses, which also brings housing and all those things closer to the action. Um, but overall, the neighborhood has just exploded since they built the light rail. It was very smart of them to do that. All right, thanks for joining us here today to hear a little bit more about Old Mecklenburg Brewery. Jocelyn, cheers. Prost.